All right, what we've got here is a 2013 Nissan Altima 2.5 SL. Now the SL trim level is the elite package for the Nissan Altima. It has a ton of standard features, leather interior, heated seats, hands-free Bluetooth system. As you can see, it's got a power siding moonroof and a ton of other features. The one that we're gonna to talk to you today about is the fact that it's got Nissan's Homelink system, which actually will eliminate the use of one of these. This is Nissan's Homelink system. What that means to the consumer is, you've got a garage door opener built into your car. Nissan chose to use it in their rear view mirror so that you can keep your eyes ahead of you, focused on what's in your garage, that way you don't run into anything. You can actually program up to three different garage door openers on this system. The setup process is fairly simple and a little bit difficult. So a lot of times we like to let people know how this works. To clear the system, what we do is we hold these two outside buttons here for about 20 seconds. The little red light that's on here will eventually start to blink. As it starts to blink, we can then let go and the system has been cleared. The next step in the process is to take your existing garage door opener remote and whichever button you choose to designate as your garage door opener and hold them down simultaneously. Once this red light that's blinking slowly starts to blink quickly, we'll know that the system has programmed the remote and you're free and clear of having to hold the remote in your car. There we go, we're all set.